Good afternoon. The first item of business this afternoon is time for reflection. And our time for reflection leader today is Gordon McRae, the Chief Executive of the Humanist Society Scotland. Thank you. Presiding Officer, members of the Scottish Parliament, thank you for the opportunity to speak to you today. Do not unto another that that you would not have him do unto you. Thou needest this law alone, it is the foundation of all the rest. This was the teaching of Confucius in 500 BC. From the Greek philosophers of, of the next 400 years through to First Nation thinkers in Australia, right up to the Abrahamic religions of more recent years, this, the golden rule, has prevailed. I find it fascinating that wherever you go on this planet, this common basic ethic of reciprocity manifests itself in nearly every human society. Communities who have never seen people with a different color of skin, tribes and clans separated by vast mountains and dark oceans, people of faith and of none, each arrive at the same conclusion. Treat others how you want to be treated. The golden rule inspires me as a humanist because it is universal, because it is the product of lived human experiences over many millennia, and because it requires me to think about others and their feelings. The golden rule is the clear default position for moral decision-making the world over, shared by all, owned by no one, truly universal. It's also what inspires me about this place, that universal mutual objective you all share, no matter the color of your rosette, to make life better for the people who put you here. For you have the opportunity to shape lives, to create change, recast society for the better. You may pull in different directions, but you each share a vision that we can build a better society. And of course, that vision is best forged in the heat of debate. Politics should be about difference, about the battle of ideas, but you, the politicians, can be about what unites us. You can inspire change by appealing to our common good. Confucius held up that the golden rule was the only law you ever truly needed. Now things would get really quiet in here if that were the case, but it can be the foundation for how our laws are approached. There are nearly as many versions of the golden rule as there are societies in the world, and I hope you will find the one that speaks most strongly to you. For me, I find the humanist perspective does it for me. One world, one life, one humanity. Thank you.